Hey guys, how are you? Please come inside. Uh, I think Gianluigi came here in uh, 2000 and I met Gianluigi because I was a good friend with his brother. So his brother introduced me to Gianluigi and um, you know, we became friends since then. So uh, I probably know Gianluigi for about 13 years, give it or take it. A couple customers and they were looking for, uh, to open a gelateria. And um, you know, he told me that uh, he was looking for like, a good location with a very good rent and, and started the, the business for those people. So, you know, we keep talking about it and then we come out to, you know, the idea that we were going to do it together. And this place actually was supposed to be uh, kind of like a display, it's kind of like a, a showroom of our product. So I sell the coffee to this place, coffee that I make myself, and he sells the gelato on this place. This business is actually named Magico. Magico is a M-A because my name is Marcello, G-G-I because it means Gialuigi and co as CEO for company. So it was Marcello Gialuigi company. He's doing business at Dolce Gelati Cafe because uh, I would probably say that like 90% of the business that we do right now is generated by the, the gelato. So for Gialuigi, uh, then he owns a company called Dolce Gelati. He wants it to keep like a, kind of like a, his a footstep on this business. And that's why we call it Dolce Gelati Cafe. Our bosses make it a very friendly environment and I think that helps with the customers as well. Um, you know, it's not work, 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 it's like work and play, you know, so I get to have fun on the job while still being, you know, a serious worker. Explain the difference between the, the ice cream and the gelato is the difference that you can actually feel it on your own without going into the, the production, you know, the difference that you will see it without being an expert is then, uh, for example, the ice cream that you buy, that you eat, is usually frozen. It's not melting, it's just frozen, you know, and the reason why the, the gelato is actually something that you can actually melt, like a Nutella on your bread, for example, is because uh, since the gelato has less fat, the frozen temperature then requires is less than the, is less than, uh, than the ice cream. So that's why the, the ice cream that has more fat has to be frozen at lower temperature and the gelato, which has much more healthy, doesn't have to. And that's why the gelato is kind of like melting and the ice cream is frozen. When we taste the mango, when you taste the lemon, when you taste any other gelato that we have on display, you will feel refreshed by the gelato that you have. The, the difference is that when you, after you have the, the ice cream, you kind of feel that your throat is like a, kind of like a, a crispy or itchy. And also you feel the need of washing your mouth because the fat is still in your mouth. When you wash the gelato, you can actually finish it and feel fine with it. You don't feel the need of like uh, cleaning your voice or, 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 or washing your mouth with Listerine. That's the difference. I like the salted caramel a lot because um, you know, it is sweet, but it's also a little bit salty. And again, you know, that's like a Gialuigi's creation. I'm sure other gelateria, they have their own way of uh, making the salted caramel. But the one that he does is like a salty at, at the right spot. You know what I mean? It's not too much and it's not too less. It's just, uh, in my opinion, just perfect. And that's what I like it because it's different. Uh, my favorite flavor is definitely either cookies and cream or chocolate. Most popular flavor is salted caramel or chocolate, probably. Um, I only discovered the gelato place a few weeks ago, actually, which is sad because I'm moving out to Tacoma Park after 10 years tomorrow. Um, but I've had a lot of friends in town recently, and I've taken them all here every single time. It's delicious. Everybody should come here. Goodbye, guys. Please come back and try us.